performers in recent years. Exactly what Wigan Athletic are hoping to become after last season's promotion. This is very much an early test of their credentials in this division. Just three home wins for Norwich in the Premier League last season. But something of a party atmosphere ahead of kickoff. Well, here is how they line up today. Norwich City have made two changes from last week's opening defeat in Cardiff. One of those is enforced through the suspension of Grant Hanley after his red card last week. Ben Gibson comes in as captain to replace him, having recovered from a calf injury. Notably, there's a debut for new signing Marcelino Nunez. The Chilean international only completed his move on Tuesday, but replaces Josh Sargent in the starting lineup. Another new boy, Gabriel Sara, is on the Norwich bench for the first time, having signed this summer from Sao Paulo. There is just the one change for Wigan from last week's opening draw with Preston. Jack Watmore started every league game for the club last season, but the centre-back misses this one with the injury that forced him off in the first half of that game against North End. Curtis Tilt, as he was a week ago, is his replacement. Otherwise, it's team involvement, so McGuinness will lead the line, supported by last season's top scorer, Will Keane. Picturesque setting ahead. The home side harbour the greater level of expectation today as they get the action underway. It's not particularly important, you suspect, for the home side. They're hoping to set the standards for this championship campaign. First involvement for the new boy, Marcelino Nunez. With Grant Hanley suspended. Shitsa to uh, Nunez. to Janoulis what's there to be struck and it actually hit Cantwell Marcelino Nunez that had the initial shot his teammate in the way which could have taken it anywhere very congested on the edge of the Wigan penalty area and well have been offside anyway only had a few days so far to get up to speed at the club he did start last weekend Jason Kerr coming in alongside him today with Jack Watmore missing in that Good. step up in level certainly today Wigan could be under pressure here Rashica looking for Puki and finding Temu Puki Curtis Tilt with a block Cantwell. And Puki will chase after this. And gets to it ahead of Curtis Tilt. It's Temu Puki, and it's a whisker away. And he looks up for this from the start. So it will feel probably he should have dealt with it. Puki got the better of that particular duel. So he always made himself available for the ball early on, Marcelino Nunez. Put in on loan last night, 19-year-old. European under-19 champion with from Campwell, but not where he wanted it. Might still be able to make something of it, though. Now Nunez. Rashica has continued his run, and he did get his foot to the ball first as Amos came out. Had to be turned away from trouble in the end by Tilt. It's a bit more promising for Norwich City. A bit more guile and inventive. They've gone for the man-marking policy, haven't they? The corner eventually comes in and Nunez gets something on it. So did Puki. Gibson's shot is blocked. They only managed one of those in the entirety of the game at Carnage City last week. Nunez. Another example of his ability to switch the play. Janulis tried to deliver into a dangerous area. A long way inside his own territory, and it might come for James McLean, who was too strong for Nunez, but Aarons intervenes for the throw. Marcelino Nunez. 
Puki with a flick. Mashitsa, and still, as well to deliver the cross. It's just over the head of Todd Cantwell, though. Nunez has been at the heart of it, so too Cantwell. Just over hit for Aarons, McLean back doing his defensive duties. It's all being played in the Wigan half. As far as uh, Rashica, Sorensen, who had the initial effort. And now Nunez! And that was so close. Well, they've done everything but score, really, in the opening stages, Norwich City. Marcelino Nunez saw the, uh, the glory in his sights on debut. Nunez had spotted him. All the early optimism around Caro Road is uh, under threat of dissipating. For their first goal of the new championship season is suddenly a little more urgent now. The Wigan found theirs through McLean. On the problems for Dean Smith early on today. His side got here by way of a response. There's a great Stephen Kenny keeps on picking him for his country. Actually, first worked with at Derry City before he made the move to English football with Sunderland all those years ago now. It was back in 2011. And appealing for the, uh, the free kick, which uh, initially didn't appear forthcoming but the referee has now given it <laughs> so we know Nunez also came across to make the challenge I thought for a split second or so he got away with that one but not to McGuinness hearts in mouths for a moment for Norwich City but now they can counter with Nunez. Puki is on the move through the middle. Terence, he did really well to come away with that. Well, that's ten minutes now of the first half. Marcelino Nunez for Norwich City. Control is up against Naylor, who just... Looking ...to rebuild that midfield after the likes of... ...to uh, discover the attacking threat that they posed before that. Despite plenty of possession. Centre backs possession inside their own half. It's been a, a feature of the first half. There's Nunez. Fast feet as he combines with uh, Max Aarons, who is then caught by McLean. Tight to the touchline. That's looked lively, Nunez. I suspect there will be much more to come from him once he gets fully acclimatised. His tilt has given it away. It isn't punished for that by uh, Nunez. His touch was an errant one this time. Job replacing Daniel Farker. Something of a, an instant impact. He won his first game in charge. Briefly raised hopes of. Because at half time it is uh, Wigan Athletic who lead. Smith's side have uh, been on top for much of the half, but unable to find the finishing touch. James McLean, though, did just that for Wigan just before the half-hour mark after Ben Gibson had presented possession to the visiting side. And Liam Richardson's team have taken full advantage. They've been clinical. Norwich profligate in the first half. At the break at Carrow Road, it's Norwich City nil, Wigan Athletic 1. without a key figure at centre-back and he suspended Grant Hamley to yellow cards and received in Cardiff in the uh, Premier League he's a regular in the top flight for the Canaries last year and worked this well for Max Aarons there's Rashica 
Nunez trying to touch it off to uh, Kiefer Ahrens at every opportunity. Such an outlet coming forward from fullback. Nishitsa isn't quite going to reach that one from Marcelino Nunez. There's a tempo and I think to Max Ahrens. Keen dropping deeper. He's quickly surrounded by uh, Norwich players, but he did beautifully to. In that country, obviously the first Cuban to play in the uh, English Premier League. There is Temu Puki picking up the pieces and possession, finding Rashitsa. They have the spare man. It's Max Aaron's. It's one-one. Wonderfully worked Norwich City equaliser. Their first goal of this championship season at this level, and this one has given Norwich City a. A platform to perhaps push on from. Nunez delivers the ball in. Cantwell trying to return it with the reverse ball in towards Onel Hernandez. Wigan will get the free kick. Tom Naylor. Cantwell provides one and returns it to it. Nunez beaten to that by Naylor. Outed enough there. Again from Keane, but this time he was caught in possession by Marcelino Nunez. Hernandez. Taking on that Derequa. Hunting it in beyond everybody. Person late last season. An indication maybe that he was going to figure more prominently in his plans. This is Aaron's. Norwich's goal scorer. Trying to turn provider here. Nunez, Nishitsa, Washington probing in possession in a, a dangerous part of the pitch. Nunez once more, going for glory. And he would have known from the moment that left his left boot that it. Peel from uh, Ben Amos because he got nothing on it. Now Nunez. The claim was tenacious though, and Fortune favoured him to come away with that. Tries to slide it into the run of Callum Lang. From promotion, but they were ultimately beaten at Wembley by Nottingham Forest. As Wigan advance here with Humphreys. Might have to do it all on his own. Wasn't able to do that. The claim gets a, a foot in, but Cantwell is there. A potentially sparkly counter-attack if uh, Hernandez can keep it in. Wigan felt that had gone out of play, and uh, Hernandez was permitted to continue. Well, they will uh, make the change. And given that he only signed on Tuesday, it's no great surprise that Marcelino Nunez is coming off at this juncture. But shown that enough on debut to suggest he will have a big part to play, may well become a favourite here. Sonali playing for his Norwich City future maybe can straight draw to start the championship campaign for Wigan Athletic. Full time at Carrow Road, Norwich City 1, Wigan Athletic 1.